Okay, to be very honest, during lockdown, I fell off the wagon and lost a lot of my healthy habits that I used to not even have to think about. So, now we're gonna get back on track and we've got the perfect sponsor for this video, iHerb. I love working with iHerb and I've collaborated with them many times in the past and I was a customer for the longest time, even before I started my YouTube channel. So what I love about iHerb is that they carry over 30,000, 30, thousand natural products on their website and they deliver to over 185 countries and they have 24 hour 24 7 customer service in 10 languages so in this video i'm going to show you some of the habits that i want to incorporate back into my life and have them be things that i don't have to think about and i don't have to struggle to do they just like happen naturally like before and with the help of some products from iherb um this is going to be a bit easier and i'm gonna talk to you about some of these products what i like about them and of course like always everything uh, all the links are going to be in the description box so make sure to check that out and yeah let's get on with the video so this is a one liter water bottle that I'm going to be carrying with me everywhere um, have it next to me all the time because when you have like accessible water whether it's like water, healthy snacks you're more likely to drink them or eat them it's very dry in Riyadh, the city I live in incredibly dry every time I wake up I feel like my eyes I feel like there is sand in my eyes and it's not a good feeling but when I drink enough water I don't get that problem anymore and my digestive system is a lot better uh, my skin is better ev everything i just feel so much better i forgot my headphones what a great start to my day I swear to God, it's like when you think it can get any hotter, it gets hotter. Anyways, good news, I finished liter number two. I'm on my third liter, it's only 2 p.m. So, really happy about that. And yeah, let's go get some work done. Okay, so we got the water down. Yesterday I had over four liters of water, so I'm really happy about that. And honestly, just having a huge water bo bottle by me at all times made it so much easier. Like I didn't even have to think about it or force myself. Now, let's talk the supplements that I take. The first supplement that I take is obviously B12. I used to think that B12 is only a vegan issue, but it's more than that. And it's not a flaw with the vegan or plant-based diet. So um, you can read more about that. So I know a lot of vegans take this matter lately um, or refuse to take B12 altogether. But please, um, if you are deficient in B12, you could get, let's say, symptoms or whatever that are irreversible. Um, and the damages can be very severe. So and any extra... Any excess B12 that you take, your body is easily going to get rid of um, with your urine because it's a water-soluble vitamin. So this is not an I take. I got it from iHerb. I've been using it for years. It's just a spray that you spray under your tongue. Very easy. So I'm planning to take probiotics again because even though my mental health has improved significantly in the last couple of months and even on my bad days I'm feeling like it's nothing compared to before but I have been a lot more stressed than before um, and I just like have so many things on my plate right now so it's been affecting my digestive system because I do have IBS so I've decided to take probiotics again so it's from Renew Life it has 30 billion live cultures and 12 probiotic strains if you didn't know this already your mental health can greatly affect your digestive system and vice versa 
uh, there's a study that proved, I'm gonna link the study in the description box too. I'm paraphrasing here, but taking probiotics for more than one month has been proven to significantly decrease symptoms of anxiety, depression, uh, anger, and hostility. I don't know, it breaks my heart that someone can go through these things because I know depression and anxiety can wreck your life and can be the worst thing ever. So if probiotics might help then why not obviously consult your doctor before taking them so you can take probiotics at any time in your day whatever works best for you but for the best best results it's better to take them 30 minutes before uh, your meal and it's better that the meal contains some fat so probiotics um sometimes i used to make like vegan yogurt with probiotics I can find the, the recipe on my blog. Okay, the other supplement that I'm taking is magnesium. Obviously, you can get magnesium from food, um, unless like, as long as you don't have any problems with it, your digestive system and your digestive system is not absorbing the nutrients properly. So sometimes taking supplements can be very effective, um, especially at the beginning. So I decided to take magnesium because it can reduce uh, stress and um, it's good to like relax your muscles um, and I've been working out consistently the last couple of weeks and sometimes my muscles would like spasm I think that's the right word so I figured this would really help so this is my favorite flavor just add half a teaspoon to a little bit of little bit of water and then mix that well and then add more cold water uh, or you can do warm water or whatever you prefer um, I like the orange flavor the most but they do have one that's unflavored and they have lemon and raspberry they have so many other different flavors so just see what which one you like I really love orange and it's certified vegan and gluten-free and it has no sugar no fructose or artificial color or flavor and it is sweetened with like um, organic uh, stevia leaf so the ingredients are really clean and then I think having a little bit of like organic stevia is not that bad for you so I take this before I go to bed um, just to unwind me a little bit more and I forgot to mention the containers are made from 100% post-consumer plastic so just I just add this much That's it with the supplements I'm taking right now. The next habit that we have is that I want to get back to eating or drinking or whatever, consuming more vegetables and fruits. Right now in Saudi Arabia, we have a lot of fruits in season, like prickly pears, and I love prickly pears so much. And they're actually very good for your digestive system, for your colon. And um, figs are in season right now too. And Saudi figs, you would not believe it. They are so good um, and dates obviously are now in season if you didn't know August is usually when uh, we have a lot of like date festivals and we're har harvesting all of the dates anyways let's go, go have some fruits okay this is me eating my vegetables so we've got some um, vegan psyche it's just vegetables tomato sauce the recipe is on my website and I'm trying to eat salads more often so this salad has some leafy greens, parsley, um, chickpeas, beets um, the beets are steamed or boiled I'm going to take my probiotics okay fun fact I don't like to swallow pills but this one is not that bad I've gotten a lot better. I didn't start swallowing pills until I was in college. Alright, we need water. And down she goes. So I'm making a salad dressing. I'm using one uh, spicy cashew butter. If you don't have spicy cashew butter, just use cashew butter and add some like chili sauce or something and salt. And then I'm going to add some uh, pomegranate molasses and a little bit of balsamic vinegar some black pepper some sea salt I'm going to add some water to this and just mix it well and add it to the salad I'm going to add some oregano Oh, 
Okay, here it goes. It's taking everything that I've got not to hit the smooth button right now. Good morning. Okay, so today I did wake up early and that felt amazing. I love mornings so much. It's just, it's been really hard to get out of bed, but I'll find a way. Even though I tried all the hacks, And that's it for this video. Thank you so much to IR for sponsoring this video. And remember to check out the description box for any info. Let me know what kind of health or wellness resolutions you want to incorporate. I did work out more consistently this week too. And I think it's just because like I was planning to have it part of this video, but I didn't want it to be too, like I didn't want it to have too many things. But I've noticed that once I was like waking up a little bit earlier, eating um like a lot of nutrient dense food like lots of vegetables um and fruits i just naturally been going to the gym more often and doing yoga more often and uh even like my recovery has been a bit faster which is great and i think that has to do with like the amount of water i've been drinking too yeah let me know what you're planning to do um what your health resolutions are uh, maybe you've stayed on track maybe you haven't and you want to get back whatever just let me know and thank you so much for watching Bye. <laughs> <laughs>